I'm Nathan reporting for First Updates Now. I'm here with 2451 Ponage at the Midwest Regional. I'm here with uh, Evelyn, David, and Colin. They're going to tell us about their awesome robot today. So Evelyn, uh, do you want to tell us about your encoders, I believe? Yeah. So we have uh, magnetic encoders on our claw, on our elevator, and on our intake. And we use, we connect those with magnetic limit switches. So we're able to, when this is right here, the um, sensor trips and so we know this intake is all, right, all the way back and we have one right here also so when this goes all the way down the magnet will trip that sensor so we know that's all the way down and it's the same sort of concept on the claw and the elevator also. That's really cool and uh, do you want to talk about your I think pile drivers right? The pile drivers are mounted on the well there's two parts of that there's the winglets which are mounted to the center carriage of the elevator and so when the elevator lifts when we go to climb the elevator lifts up then some pneumatic uh, micro cylinders pull this pin right here, and this winglet, which is spring loaded by via pivot point, and that surgical tubing flips out, and then that would be up here when that happens. And I'll push this pile driver through some linear bearings through the center frame, pushing up one side of the robot, and then the intake lifts the other side of the robot. And uh, David, you want to tell us about your carbon fiber intake? It looks like it's pretty effective and it's quite awesome. Yes, I do. So uh, our intake is made mostly out of carbon fiber. What this will do is feed in, and everything is connected via bevel gears, and this one's down by a belt. So what this does is it pinches the cargo at two different points, and it can even feed us in from the side when we're trying to pick, us, pick cargo out of the depot. Once we get it up, we pinch it, fold back, and then we can actually back feed it into this claw mechanism, which then, as this intake goes up, and this claw, up and this allows us to go all the way up to score all even on the highest level of the rocket ship. And then my last question is how are you guys able to pick up hatches? Do you use that same uh, intake? So for picking up hatches we use this mechanism here which is mount we have a cylinder mounted on and then a rail mounted or a plate mounted on a linear THK rail which slides out the finger back and forth. What happens is as you go to pick up a hatch this this actuates out then when you grab the hatch, the hatch pushes these flaps back, the finger goes inside the hatch, and then the elevator lifts up and pulls the hatch out, and then the winglets keep the hatch sprung against the finger until you're ready to place. When you place, you just do the same thing. You push in until the finger goes into the hatch, and then you pull down and uh, place the hatch on any of the levels of the rocket or cargo ship. So thank you guys very much, and uh, good luck today.